Okay, we have an illegal demonstration coming up Fifth Avenue. They came down Jackson from the east, from under the freeway, and they made a left turn here on Fifth. Looks like we have a bicycle barricade across South Main Street. They're blocking these cars. They have the right to the road. This is an unpermitted street demonstration. They do not have a permit to use the road. This bicycle barricade is illegal. Let's get a good look at these guys. Wave your hands. You are blocking a road illegally. Now they go. Letting these cars up. One more block. This is July 3rd, 2020. Here in Seattle, on 5th Avenue, just south of the Yesler Bridge. And now they're blocking at Washington Street. Here's a little encampment in what had been storefronts. Blocking the street. Illegally blocking the street. None of these people have a permit to be doing this. None. July 3rd, 2020, in Seattle on Fifth Avenue at Washington. None of these people have a permit. None. Hey neighbors, would you please stop filming us? Fuck you! I will film you because I'm on a public sidewalk. I can film whatever the fuck I want. Understood. Thank you very much. You don't tell me I don't film. Understood. Thank you very much. You want to do something illegal? You have no right to privacy. I'm sick and tired of you fuckers getting away with breaking the law. You're blocking this traffic, you have the right to the road. And you don't have a permit you so admitted yourself. And yeah, the man in blue with the white bicycle told me they do not have a permit. Sir, I invite you to direct your complaints to Jenny Durkin. I'll put them on the internet and Jenny can watch as Just like everyone else. Are we ready to fall all the way, Natalie? Yeah. Natalie's the name of one of the persons illegally blocking this road. Saul says the blue shirt guy. And as usual, the police are nowhere to be found even though we're about three blocks south of their main station. Next to the Seattle Municipal Court building, right up Fifth Avenue on the other side of the jail. A county jail that isn't accepting any misdemeanor arrests for booking. That's turning Seattle into a zombie movie. Okay, I think we've seen enough.
Okay. 